It's been a common issue with me in Attack on Titan. Every single time I think about the next episode, I get hype and I'm like, let's go. And then I think about the horrible things that happened last episode, like how it ended with Connie's scream. And I'm like, oh yeah, we live in fucking hell. This is, this is horrible, but I'm still so excited for this episode. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with Attack on Titan Season 4, Episode 27 or 87 total, I believe. Uh, 86 total. This one is called Retrospective. Last episode, we had our plan take the flying boat, go stop Eren. It ended up going crazy. The Azumabito Flock and Ki Kiyomi, I think her name is. Flock is just crazy. Don't get me started on Flock, but it all shit hit the fan when Armin and Connie tried to convince Samuel and Daz to take the explosives off the flying ship because we're working together. And when Flock finally let everyone know that we are traitors and then Samuel shot Armin like four times and then Connie had to kill Sam and Daz. And I watched some videos and I read some comments from you guys showing the times in which we've seen Daz and Samuel. And I'm like, oh my God, they really have been there from the beginning. Like when Sasha first stole the meat, it was Samuel and Connie, they were the first two to say, that's why he brought it up with Connie. He was like, yo, we're gonna, let's win this war, go free our land, let's go get some eat meat. And then you had Daz, who's just been scared the entire time. You like, I, I saw, he's in the, okay. This is crazy, super sad, they're dead. They're old friends, like I'm saying, this is just horrible, but we need to do what we need to do. So we're gonna do it. We're gonna find out what happens. I can't wait any longer. Let's watch this episode. Don't forget if you guys want to watch this episode live with me or the other shows I'm watching live, we are live on Twitch right now, twitch.tv slash Darius. You can see the chat going crazy right now telling you guys to come over here. It is a great time, great vibes. Don't forget if you guys want to watch the early access or full length though to the other shows, check out that Patreon. All the links for everything are always in the description down below. Don't forget to check out the other social medias, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, all at Dapper Darius. Don't forget to hit that sub button, click that bell so you guys always know when I post on the Dapper channel. Much appreciated. Let's hop into this. Attack on Titan, Season 4, Episode 27, and or Episode 86 overall. This one's called Retrospective. Let's do this. Yeah, it didn't work, which sucked, but that shot of Annie and Reiner coming in was one of the coolest of the season. For that such emotional scene to be interrupted by this fucking insane violence. Let's go, Annie. I'm sorry. I get that some of you guys are Yakerist, but I gotta be Team Reiner and Annie right here. An entire day? Four days and the world is over. Oh, I know. Yeah, literally even step one of this plan is impossible and then we're just adding on 50 other things that make this plan damn near impossible to do. What is that? Okay, how long would that voyage take though? A gamble, that's all we got at this point. We literally have nothing else we can rely on. I love how Magath is wearing a scout's uniform too. He looks so damn badass in that. I love this song. This is a great song to start the episode off on. Okay. If we go back to season one, I'm pretty sure they played this song when we're fighting Annie a couple of times. Like, what are we going to do about this girl? How are we going to take her out? Mikasa's in the fray too. You guys can't tell me if Magath wasn't a Marlene and he was an Eldian from the start. Like, let's say he was a, like right under Levi, right under fucking Ervin. He wouldn't have been an amazing soldier. He would have been so good on our squad. I really fuck with Magath. I really fuck with Magath. I really fuck with Magath. Yeah, we need some shields, right? Oh. Good. Good little armor. Thunder spears. Ooh. Good shots? Who's sniping up there? We know Magath got the shot. Deal with the female later. They are smart. It's a smart plan. Sacrificing some of her limbs to eat that form. A literal limb. Shouts out Annie. Shouts out Reiner. Shouts out Reiner. 
Oh my god, those Thunder Spears are so formidable. If anyone else said it, I'd be like, Shinzo Sasagio! We got Peek and everyone else ready to board. Yes, I agree. Peek definitely needs to join, but she is watching them right now, so it makes a lot of sense. And I get why you're saying that. Porco would be Porco would be so needed right now. He'd be so nasty. But I'm very curious to see what Falco's jaw titan looks like. No, we're losing limbs. Shouts out, Connie. Oh, I was smart. Going out down in the water, coming back up right next to the ship. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. Does he even know how to control his powers at all? Oh no, we got a train coming in. <gasps> Who did that? Oh, Falco, stop. Oh my god, and he's getting fucking obliterated. So is Reiner. They're really putting in, they've really given their all to protect them right now. Her head is blown off. I mean, it makes sense. Connie to save the two who betrayed him, and he's the most against traitors of his friends. This animation is fucking sweet. Oh my god, my man Connie's a legend. Come on. Mikasa coming in too. I need this. Good. Beyblade action. Clean. I feel so bad killing these guys, but I don't at the same time, man. If we hesitate, the rumbling won't stop. That's the thing. I feel bad, but you cannot hesitate. Wipe that blood off your face. We know of, in terms of mobility, Peak is right next to the Jaw Titan. Peak is pretty damn quick. Everyone is fighting their hearts out right now. This shit is so intense. Motherfucking Falco! Oh my god, I'm starting to get teary-eyed. This guy is fucking insane. He's he's probably the coolest looking jaw titan we've seen, and I thought that couldn't be possible. Porco! Oh, he's got like fur and shit? This guy looks like an Elden Ring boss. Oh my god. Oh my god, this animation, he stopped it with a Thunder Spear. Falco block is actually kind of nice right now. Oh my god, why is... That might have been the coolest thing Flock has ever done in his entire life. With the music too? With this music? It was off target. Gabby the Sniper. Oh my god. This shit is so symbolic. It literally looked like a sea of blood like he was just talking about. This woman, this animation is some of the cleanest animation in terms of the ODM shit. Oh my god, I love how up close and personal they're getting. We're seeing every slash and cut. Fucking shish kebab, my boy! What the? I know I have some friends personally who have complained about Mikasa not getting some limelight this season. What the flying fuck, Mikasa, with that turn? Oh my god, is he gonna even be able to control his powers right now? Yeah, see, this is what I'm worried about. Cut him out nice and easy like we used to do to Aaron back in the day when Aaron would have these episodes. Thank you. Falco's been- oh, it really was a sea of blood. I knew they didn't just do that artistically. Oh my god. He said he was defending the rear. He's not staying, is he? I, I know he said he's defending the rear. I don't want him to die for it. My man Keith Shadies. Coming in clutch. That's who blew up the train. That's who we saw on the window while they were leaving. That's who it was the whole entire time. Okay. I like it. I would never, ever in my days expecting these two to work on a covert mission together. No, Magia. 
No, Keith. No. I don't need two legends going out like this. He is the one we saw in the window. He's like, man, the Avengers. Right? Especially with Keith's backstory, man. With everything with uh, Grisha and Carla and everything, you know? I'm glad these two found this respect for each other in his last time, you know. <laughs> they don't even know each other's names, man. Ooh. Yeah, how is Annie gonna take this man with her father and everything? That's her only motivation. But we do know that he had his own like insurrection in Liberio, so maybe he made it out. We don't know. That is true. That is true. God damn, man. God damn. I'm gonna have to keep this discussion short just because I know I'm gonna get emotional talking about it. But, absolutely fantastic episode. The music, the score, the animation, the motivations that everyone, you could tell, this was a very climactic moment. This was the climax. Everyone was putting their lives on the line just so we have the chance. Not even so it's confirmed or anything. It's still, there's still a good chance we can't even do this, but just so we have the chance of doing this, you know? And I love the way how they set up Keith, like being that one from, we saw the window a few episodes ago. And we never got that answer to how he's been doing stuff on the low key till now and how they played off till now. And it was just so well done. The him and Keith, the K Keith and uh, Magath conversation with them both sort of owning up to their mistakes, recognizing each other and respecting each other, but not even knowing each other's names. So well done, man. I got to give one more to them. They deserve it. Whew. I know Keith's been there from from literally like episode like three, so it's like it's got it's crazy, you know. Ooh, I just know that everyone else feels like that emotional weight too, like Hanji, Gabby, Falco. Falco was crazy this episode. Flock, Mikasa, Hanji, John, Connie, everyone had a moment to shine. Ooh, god damn, that shit was crazy. Ah, uh, I don't know. I didn't know Attack on Titan could still do that to me. It's been a minute since I cried like that. I think you guys who have seen my Attack on Titan reactions extensively can remember the last Attack on Titan reaction where I cried like that. It was, ooh, it was a minute ago, but fantastic episode. Loved it. Retrospective, great title for it, especially with the whole Keith and Maga thing at the end, you know. Everything you can put into a, a retrospective lens, you know. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please make sure to like, subscribe, all that jazz. Click that bell. Check out the Twitch if you guys want to watch me cry live, all that jazz. Check out that Patreon, full length, early access, all that. I'm going to go rethink life, all that jazz. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day after squad. Peace.